Here on the 20th of May 2021, the National Hurricane Center has released their 2021 seasonal outlook for the Atlantic. They are expecting an above average season. On average, we get about 14 named storms per year. They're saying about 13 to 27 hurricanes, expecting about 6 to 10 in major hurricanes three on average and we could see upwards of five now there are a few reasons for this uh some of it actually just goes back even to last few years last six seasons we've had above average seasons so i mean why not this one well it's been active actually stretching back to 1995 and here's the other thing this is the big one the one right there in the middle the ansel is neutral to a weak la nina out there and what that simply means conditions are just a bit more conducive for tropical development in the Atlantic. And we already seen personally on other parts of the world, we've already seen strong storm systems, partly due to that above average sea surface temperatures associated with the La Nina. Even the strongest typhoon um, on record in the month of April near the Philippines, that was Typhoon Sergei, and we've already had the strongest cyclone on record to make landfall in the Arabian Sea. So I mean, they're, they're, it's already an active season globally. Like, but let's go back to the Atlantic. The stats going uh, from year to year. And you can see over the last few years, we have been in this spike right there. Stretching back to the mid-90s of these above average seasons. Now, already we've been watching an area out there in the Atlantic for development. Our season typically doesn't peak, though, until August heading into September. But... Right now, at least here in mid-May, it does look like an above average outlook. These long range numbers though, they're just one of those things that you have to keep in mind. Uh, it is not really a forecast. It's more of a rough estimate on what we could expect in the upcoming season based on climatology and some of those conditions going on globally.